Greetings and salutations, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm gonna spare you my my, my accent today. I'm a little too and yet a little too hmm, because as you heard and the LGBT has taken another good blow from our good friend Pat Robinson. Apparently he has a theory, as you just heard me say in my last video about conspiracy theories, but that was about Syria and not the current war. However, this is about how you spread AIDS to people. I don't want to go into it too much. All I can tell you is it is the single most stupidest thing I've heard conservatives say. And you know, I'm not gonna pretend I'm little Miss Goody Goody Two Shoes or anything here. Yeah, no, it's I use that term, <laughs> but because I did have that video talking about AIDS and you know, basically telling everyone to go get tested. Not because I assume everyone had, has AIDS, it's just I look at the CDC, it's all very high level. Well, anyway, let's call it in for everyone below the ages of, we'll say 35. I have ages of 35 who are having this issue. They also state that. It's high amongst the LGBT society. And I felt, you know, I do something kind and generous and talk about it as a whole, since a lot of people don't really like to talk about it in the South. Okay? However, Pat decides that um, how it's done is you, the homosexuals out there get rings and put it on your fingers and cut people with it and then pass it around. <laughs> yeah. Way to go, Pat. Way to go. Yeah, smart Pat. Swear. You know, I'm a Christian and thankfully, thankfully, I ain't that stupid. I'm not saying I know everything about sex. Um, I guess I've had the talk three times. Enough is enough, folks. That's, but I believe in being knowledgeable about it, everything as much as possible. I'm just saying I've had it three times. What one remembers is what one remembers. As I plan on learning more about it, but. I also like talking about it, obviously. Not because... Not because I'm, I'm like that, or anything of that quality. I just think this is... When I heard that story on the Young Turks, I wanted to hurt Pat. It made me very, very angry. I'm not so angry. I'm really thinking about making another video where, yes, I talk about it, but I also include, you have to be infected hit with the stuff already, and it's usually through sexual, through, uh, sexual, uh, how to put it, um, vaginal or penis discharge. You also had to get out of blood of an infected person. You cannot pass it through rings. Yes, you can get it from, like, nails, needles and stuff, but again, it must go through the blood of an infected person. Okay? Jesus. Get educated at, at past. God. God almighty, I... This is you know, I don't understand people who... who, who you know, I'm not saying I know, like I said, I don't know everything about sex. But again, 
fly. But again, I understand he's old. I understand he's on the 700 Club. God knows he needs to get, he needs to get off, okay? He also needs to stay away from certain parts of the country. Yes, there are some people who are the good Christians and they're basically going, like, yes, yes, we're sorry, we're sorry, our leaders being a little unhinged. But still. I want to apologize to the gay community. Oh, no, I don't even like to say that. I don't even feel like I have the right to say that word because of that reason. I want to talk, I want to apologize to the LGBT and AQ. I remember hearing that you guys added on an extra member of that, of your society, or group, to that society, so, yeah, I don't know. Oh, that's just all how much I know about that. Anyways, I want to apologize for Pat and his stupidity, okay? Because as a Christian, I believe that has got to be the most unnerving, frustrating thing to ever hear about. Okay. Oh, good. I like that. You guys can see my eyes. This is so creepy. I just feel like that. Anyways, thank you for listening, and again, I apologize for Pat. Pat, and you haven't heard the story, I will try to link it down below in the description, and you can watch it there. I wish I could show it here on my video, but as you see, I'm not quite talented at yet at editing, so bear with me, folks. Sorry, flies or maybe. Anyways, please, if you can, follow me on my Tumblr, my Twitter, at, at this is Evelyn O'Malley. Sign it.